stay down. Take a seat. <sighs> Forgive me if this is rude, but I'll cut right to the chase, my boy. Hmm? I don't know what's going on between you and Hamura, but there's nothing I can do to help. What do you mean? You're not even going to hear my side of the story? You'd just be wasting your time. Hamura's been bankrolling the family for a while now. I get by on the scraps he leaves me. I'm... I'm just a figurehead. But... The clan will do the things I ask of them, yes. But if they had to choose between my orders and Hamura's, who knows? Maybe they would choose not to hear me. How long has it been like this? Years. The prime of my career was... Well, it ended back when I was raising you. Atsugane-san. If only Kaito was still in the family, maybe things wouldn't have turned out like this. We're not done here. Actually, we are. I have a message from Captain Hamura, Yagami-san. He says to go see him right away. He's waiting for you at Cafe Alps. He wants to talk. Fine. I'll head over when I feel like it. Don't piss him off, Yagami-san. Unless you want to lose your eyes, too.
Welcome, sir. Please, take a seat wherever you'd like. I didn't think you'd try to pull that. Running off and telling an adult. Like a fucking child. Oh, I just thought that the guy who actually runs the show would want to be able to keep tabs on his captain. He doesn't need to. So you keep your goddamn nose out of this shit. Understand? Or do I need to spell it out? Yeah. I'm hearing you loud and clear. So... I guess we're done here. We're not done until I say so. don't really work on you, do they, Talk? Well, I guess you always have been a fighter. None of us thought you'd last a day in law school. But you sure showed us. Went to night classes, passed the bar. You say you're done, but a guy with balls like you doesn't give up. You fought for your lawyer's badge, but trash with a badge is still trash. And it's about time to take you out. Ozaki! Ready to die? Huh? Oh, enough of this. You're dead! <sighs> this is some bullshit. You already went. Huh? It's only fair I take my turn. Ugh! <laughs> 
about the eyes. One bullet in each. Man the fuck up, Kengo! <laughs> about this real quick. Oh. 
hit on Shiva. Finally give up? Not yet. You don't give up, do you? with it. Just who are you? I'd appreciate it. Thank you first. Why should I? After what you did to me this afternoon? I gave your phone back, didn't I? Then why even take it? What was the point of it? I was trying to get away from a cop. The asshole just wouldn't get off my case. But when I saw you on the phone, I had the greatest idea. Okay, go on. Well, I guess the first step was taking your phone. I knew you'd end up following me after that. Then, seeing you and me running in the same direction, the cop would think you were my buddy. And while he took his sweet time arresting you, I was gonna escape. I have to say, never thought you'd actually get away from him too, though. Eh. Guess all's well that ends well, yeah? And just now? Why'd you come save me? Good question. Why did I do it? Eh, beats me. <laughs> Interesting stuff. <laughs> Let's just say I wanted to apologize for stealing your phone. Lucky break, huh? You'd have got your brains blown out if it wasn't for me. You're telling me? Guess I owe you. In which case, we're even now. Hey. Why are you so dead set on this burglary ring? There's gotta be something better. <laughs> what? If you're looking for work, maybe you could join us instead. <sighs> and have the Yakuza out for my head? <sighs> Fat chance. Those guys from before were Matsugane family. But, uh, the cure is also looking for me. <laughs> you sure know how to sell it. <laughs> but, I don't think we can trust each other just yet, Yagami-san. What'd you say? How do you know my name? 